Uh, good morning. I'm getting in early. This is Thursday. And I'm looking at Caulfield where we've got the prospect of a, a good to dead track. And race six is first group one of the season in um, Melbourne. And the races are on Sunday, so don't forget that because of the grand final being on Saturday. And I'm going to uh, demonstrate what I think here is a good Dutch bet. And we're going to look at a Caulfield race six. On top, I've got number 12, that's the one. Now normally I would apply a 20 point penalty to a horse like that's the one because it is second up. If we flick on through, we look at the stat here, it's had uh, two preparations, the two second up wins, uh, and uh, it's had a first up win as well. So um, it's done reasonably well last start, came from ninth at the turn to finish fourth at Mooney Valley over 1200. If we look at the stewards report, slowly away disappointed for a run. So we do have to rely on it getting away. But I've rated that's the one, a $3.50 chance. Solon Itzen. Now I saw this win in Brisbane um, just a week or so ago. And fair income, it was just like a track gallop. And uh, it just went past them like they were shot. So it hasn't raced at Caulfield before. But 10 wins from 22 starts. Second up. It has one second up. As a matter of fact, it's won its last four races in a row. I think uh, Bobby Heathcock is a good trainer, he is one of the leading trainers in Brisbane and he's brought it down here and we could get a good price on number six Solon Hitson. Okay now number nine moment of change eight starts for four wins, one start at this track for a win and uh, the distance three starts for a win and two placings. It's had two runs from a spell, one over the 1200 in a really smart time there at um, Warwick Farm when it won over 1400 last time, it uh, ran a really good time, 82.39. Last start at Warwick Farm it was third, beaten under a length. Now, I was a little bit disappointed with that run, but nevertheless, we've got to leave it in. Now, the big worry is going to be Barrier 15. At Caulfield, Barrier 15 is a little bit hard to overcome. So, I want to back those three horses. 12, that's the one. 6, Solon Hitson. 9, moment of change. Let's have a look now at the IAS bet early market. <coughs> we can see that Solon Hitson opened at $7, is into $6.50 already. But I would expect that price to stay, so I won't worry too much about that. But if you're going to uh, back that to return $100, you'd want to have $16 on that. If you have a look here at moment of change, 360 into 350 and back to 360. Um, that's not a great price, but nevertheless, we put $29 on that, we'll get a return of $100. And if we look at that's the one, it's the mover at the moment, in from $13 to $11. You only have to put $9 on that to get your money back. So that's 35 and 16, that's $51 outlay. And uh, one of those gets up, you're guaranteed to. Uh, double your money. That seems like a good deal for me. So um, as I said I am expecting the tra track possibly to be a bit damp. There is some rain coming, heavy rain on Friday I believe and plus if the track gets too firm they'll water it again on the Sunday morning. Okay, let's see how we go. Good luck.